Okay, this video is going to be short and sweet. Basically, we want to get this image and we want to get this information on our theme. Right now, it's just got this kind of bogus information here. How do we add that? Well, on this link, it is the theme inf development information. And if you scroll down, it's going to give you what you need. Now, this is kind of a magical formula that WordPress uses, and it uses comments. And this is going to be placed inside our style.css file right at the very top and this will tell um, WordPress about our theme and if you ever want to make a theme public um, this is how you record your information alright so we're gonna alter ours a little bit but it's gonna go at the top of our style page so if we go into style right now it's empty and remember we're now pointing it to this file but we still need this CSS file as core to WordPress. So now what I want to do is just add some code. Alright, so we added this code and we saved it and then if we jump back here and we refresh it, you'll see that now that information is there. So that's the first part. We got that taken care of. Now what we need to do is get this um, thumbnail working. So we go back to our main page. We take a screenshot. I'm gonna hit print screen on the PC I think it's uh, Alt Shift 4 or Option Shift 4 for a uh, screenshot on a Mac. And then once you have that, you're going to open Photoshop and create a document. And I just make sure the dimensions are 300 by 255. That's specified, uh, I'm sorry, by 225 in the WordPress documentation. I give it a name and I'll save this PSD because later on I'll probably want to change it and update it because right now the, the screenshot's pretty basic. So that's that and uh, I hit OK and then I paste in my screenshot and it's very small and I'm going to turn on my um, transform tools and shrink it down so that it fits in that area and I'm just gonna pause and do this and then come back okay so then I shrunk it down using my awesome Photoshop skills and there it is so once we have that we will save the PSD I'm going to save it inside uh, a special folder and that's going to be inside my simple WordPress assets I'm going to create a folder called Photoshop and this is just going to be a I'm going to give it the name that PSD and then save that there oops I think I saved it in the wrong place save as actually got to put it inside the Photoshop folder and I gotta optimize, save for web and devices and now this is gonna go directly into my uh, oops and I'm gonna save screenshot.jpeg uh, not .jpeg, uh, it's gotta be PNG so I'll say PNG save that inside the right location so I just go into my themes folder and drop the screenshot.png in there and then once I do that and I go back to my themes page in the dashboard here and then I refresh the page there's our theme shot so screenshot there we go so that's it we've done it our next video will talk about making our WordPress site from a static taking it from a static site to turning it into a, a CMS or a content management system which is the whole point of doing all this work. So see you in a bit.